And the first match of the evening is a no mercy match. That the championship is up for grabs. Coming up next, it will be Eddie Guerrero against Kane. This is what these superstars dream about. A chance for a title. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the United States Championship. We're just moments away from the United States Championship being defended here. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. And I'd add that he certainly has his work cut out for him here tonight. Would you agree, Byron? Yeah, this isn't going to be easy for him, that's for sure. But he knew that when he signed up for this match. Introducing the challenger from El Paso, Texas, weighing in at 228 pounds, Eddie Guerrero. Introducing the champion, weighing in at 323 pounds, he is the United States Champion, Kane. Plant your butts in those seats and get ready. The superstars are ready and so are we. Here we go. And this is one of those matches where it's hard to believe we get paid for this. Well, actually, it's hard to believe Saxton gets paid for anything. Whatever the outcome here tonight, this Brooklyn crowd is sure to be satisfied with this one. Looks like he's shutting down the carotid arteries here. And so taking a look at Kane, what kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? Kane has been giving WWE superstars nightmares for decades. At the risk of sounding presumptuous, I would suspect his opposition will have a tough time sleeping tonight. I think tonight we can expect for him to fortify his claim in this division. The feeling of fear and horrible images of unbashed destruction follow Kane wherever he goes. The fire from the pits of hell burn in eternal flame for this being who represents pure evil. Look at this. There is absolutely no wasted motion in this attack. And he lands a nice counter.
Kane is one of the most horrifying figures humanity has ever known. The demon's love of human destruction is something that strikes fear in the hearts of even the most courageous of superstars. For more than 20 years, Kane has represented human annihilation and the fires of hell. This giant who's almost seven feet tall does not care who he destroys as long as his opposition has been eradicated. The damage has been done. I didn't think this rivalry could get any hotter, but I guess I was wrong. Look at this. Eddie Guerrero looking to attack from high. Looking at it here. Vigo and Rasta, the frog splash. There is no coming back from that one. The champ kicks out at two and a half. Yeah, he's not done yet. Getting his attention with a vicious strike. Ain't no stopping him now. Kane with the excellent move to get out. Kane showing some expert prowess here. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Looks like Eddie Guerrero is off his game here. The challenger's hopes of becoming champion appear to be in serious jeopardy right now. Choke slam straight to hell. He might just win this thing right here. There's an ear fall. Yeah, no doubt about it. A lot of muscle in that 5'8 frame. Uh, he refuses to stay down. Yeah, he is super motivated tonight. This is what makes him so dangerous. Eddie Guerrero turns it around. Eddie Guerrero connecting there with a good shot. The challenger in some big trouble here. We may be looking at the beginning of the end here for the challenger. This has got to be incredibly disappointing for him, guys. Remember, he's already executed two finishers here tonight, and neither served their purpose. And now, it looks like he's at the end of his rope. Let's remember, though, guys, his opponent doesn't seem to be in great shape either. Back between the ropes. Tell me, just how much strength is carrying your opponent around like this take? Let's put it this way, Cole. Saxton would never be able to do it. This has been a war. Back now inside the ring. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. And Eddie is able to get the shoulder up. What a match. Must be nice to be able to dial it up when you need to. And the big guy is feeling awfully good about himself right now. Grounds him with the Oklahoma Slam. He's a spinning ball of energy. What a clothesline. Not where he wants to be right now. Yeah, you're not going to win many matches when you're down. A brutal slam changes the entire complexion of this match. A spectacular DDT drops him. He's not looking good here, Byron. In King of the Rasta, the frog splash. Here's his, here he goes for the win. Two. We have the crowning of a new champion.
And that's the win to start off the night. If that's the type of action we're going to get all night long, I can't wait to see the rest of the card.